Hey guys and welcome back. This is Idemus and I'm presenting to you another Baldur's Gate 3 moment. So as you all know, the combat can be a little hard on all those of us that are a little noob with the Baldur's Gate 3 system. So after you betray the goblins at the Druid Grove, the final battle at the Goblin Camp can be a little tough. It can be a little hard to go back in and uh, kill all those goblins. But we have a solution that can help just a little bit. I have found some friends and I want to show you guys what I'm talking about. These three. You can recruit these three and it's a simple conversation that you cannot fail. And they will come and help you in the fight whenever you want, even if you don't need them. There, I don't know, maybe you want to keep them for the future. That's a good idea, but let's have this conversation now. Tastes like chicken. No chicken. Tastes like fish. Gentlemen, contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. And what surprise is this? Brothers, look here. Hello, I have good sir. Tried yet another prize. Fortune favors our bellies. No, no, no. I don't want to come in your Stranger, belly. Stranger, be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show is the brand of the absolute. I am friend. I'll do you one better. I'm one of the absolute's chosen diceables. Let's go. Ooh, a 20. Nice. Indeed. How regrettable that you are. He's sad because he, he can't eat us. Food? Food. Not food. Friend. Friend? Yes, yes. You are quite articulate, Ogre. Am I not astonishing? A robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I am a gourmand. Ooh, gourmand. And you, nice. a delicacy. Were I so lucky? I notice you don't bear a brand of your own. I've no use for the absolute. Or any god. I follow two masters only. Gluttony and greed. The goblins understand my appetites. They sate my hunger for gold. And the rest sate my hunger for meat. Boss goblin give gold. We check brand. Good deal. I can make you a deal. No talk. <laughs> He's the boss. Forget the goblins, you should be fighting for me. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. Make me an offer. Tempt me. I will try. And now we have some options. Be being a paladin, this will depend on your class and some probably will be for some other classes. But I can say also this to scare them. I have a height roll in persuasion. I'll try this one. Deception, of course. And this is the simple one. Now, the trick and a little spoiler I can give you is that even if you fail all three, let's say, it still gives you the option to use one. So this is technically not so good because they should get angry, but hopefully this will not get changed after the game releases. Even if I somehow expect to get, because even if you fail at least one, they should get angry and start attacking you. So let's try with this one, Persuasion, which I, do, I like. I'll pay you in the flesh of the Fallen. You'll have your fill. Now, it's a TC20. So this is a hard one. And yeah. I get a damn 10. Probably I'm going to show you now how you can fail all of them. A slip of the tongue. 
You meant to make a better offer, surely. Yes, of course, I want to make a better one. And now I have this one. You see the other one disappeared. 20! Yes. Come now. Famished though we are, we are friends, are we not? Of course, we are friends. Take my bone horn. One blow and the ground will quake with my family name. Use it when the need arises, and never a moment before. Ogre kill everyone around, then Ogre eats them. Well spoken, <laughs> indeed. Ogre kill everyone around. Nice. Leave. We will keep close. When you are ready, sound the horn. Of course, I'm going to do it. Noble bad bodyguards for hire. Oh yeah. And now, I will show you guys what I mean by the battle. To them, we are back at the goblin camp. And now, let's prepare for the battle. You can you can find that in your stash on the main character or the character that you talk to them. You just go sword, latest, and here it is. You can just put it right here. Yeah, let's go in the battle so I can show you how they appear. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Wow, there are so many. I won't give in. Okay. It's not my turn, but I can use it. Oh yeah. I see. Stuff your belly, brother. The feast's begun. And now they are fighting for your side. Uh, just so you guys know, this is a lot of goblins, so they are not unstoppable. They do take quite a, a good amount of damage from these creatures. So be ready just in case they die. So give it all. It's not like they are coming and uh, they are just going to rip all of them. These are a lot of goblins and uh, allies. So they just wanted to say just, just that to be careful. And also, in the case that you are going to pay them 500 gold, if they die, you can loot that gold back. <laughs> so that's a nice trick for the future. Yeah, so this was the Baldur's Gate 3 moments. I'm not going to bore you with my fighting, even if I'm so bad at that. Don't forget, if you like the video, like, and maybe leave a comment with what you want me to make in the future. And also, don't forget to check my Baldur's Gate 3 gameplay series. I'll leave it in the comments. See you guys next time. Bye-bye.